In this problem, we have a light that has a motion sensor. The motion sensor has a detection range of 120 degrees as depicted. We position the light at 7 feet or 2.13 meters above the ground. We want to find how far away the light will detect motion. How do we solve this problem? So we have a triangle that we can make a right triangle with an angle of 60 degrees up top, half of the 120 because we split it in half, in an adjacent side length, and we want to find the opposite side length. So being we have a right triangle, or in other words, a triangle with one 90 degree angle, we can use the property of right triangles known as Sokotoa. Which part should we use? Well, we are working with the opposite side and the adjacent side. So we want to use the tangent of the angle is equal to the ratio of the side length opposite over the side length adjacent to that angle. This formula states that for a divan angle, the ratio of the side length opposite over the side length adjacent will always be the same for a right triangle, assuming the same angle. To get what we are solving for opposite to one side, we must multiply both sides by the adjacent side length. Now we can plug in all of our divan values. Pressing the enter key on our calculator, being sure it is in degrees, we get a distance of detection on the ground of 12.12 feet, or 3.69 meters, from the sensor's location projected on the ground. That concludes this video. Hopefully I've earned a like, share, or subscription. If you enjoyed this video, you may enjoy one of these videos as well. Let me know how I'm doing in the comments down below. Thank you for watching.